I think we could make an argument. I could make an argument that we waited way too long to get involved in World War II. And well, it I, seems to me that the Russians lost 27 million and we no. lost 400,000. Would you really have wanted to get into the war against Germany uh, no, and Japan? It's, it, I, I'm not, uh, but I am saying that we might have been able, you know, it's not just American losses, but, you know, when the bombing of Britain is going on and you see the expansionism and the pure brutality and evil of of Nazi Germany on the march, you know, there there is a point where, yes, it does become a united world responsibility to stop stop evil because, you know what, after they take down France and after they take down Poland and after they take down Hungary and after they invade the Soviet Union, you better damn well believe if they're successful, they're coming for you next. Well, (laughs) They didn't even go into Spain because Franco told him to stay the devil out of there. Yeah, that's true. And Hitler wanted to go to Gibraltar. But let me say this. You talk about evil. Who do you mean we were an ally with the greatest monster on earth, worse even than Hitler? As a a historian wrote, by the time the war started, September 1, 1939, Mm -hmm. Stalin had racked up 1,000 victims dead for every one the Nazis had killed. 1,000 to one. His his legacy. And he wound up with all the countries, Poland, Czechoslovakia, the Churchill, and we went to liberate. You're 100% accurate. I think all told it's about 30 million, according to historians. It's the worst thing, except for the possible exception of Mao Zedong. Yeah, and the Holocaust is right up there. Look, I don't. There's no easy answer to all of these questions, Pat. No, uh, there's not. But there's what not. You get down to Sean, I think, is this: Are the vital interests of the United States imperiled? Are the vital allies of the United States imperiled? You got 192 countries in this world. You got barbarians and brutalitarians from Boko Haram to Zimbabwe, all over the place, and we can't reform this world or save this world. We have to defend our part of it, I think, defend ourselves and what we can hold and defend, and you can't do it all anymore.